Hello, my name is Joe Valero, and I'm the assessment coordinator here at Fresno County Superintendent of Schools, which is a county office of education in Central California. This video is about planning test windows. Here at Fresno County, we use three different CASP windows for our schools. And we just wanna have a reminder here, this is only for CASP. CASP is the only one that we establish test windows in TOMS. LPAC, the window is already established. It's February 1st through May 31st. Each school is unique and needs different window sizes in our organization. One of our sites is consistently adding and losing students throughout the school year and the testing windows. So we set their test window for up to about six weeks, just to give us enough time to test all of our students. Our special education site, well, we give them a multiple month window to give us enough time to test all of our students on both the Smarter Balanced General Assessment and the California Alternate Assessments. We know those take a little more time, so we wanna give ourselves more flexibility to test. Our third site is our independent study site. And there, if you think about it like the Goldilocks rule, they're really in the middle. They're not as short as our um, JJC site, which is six weeks, but not the multiple months long. So they're somewhere in the middle just to allow them to test their students because there's an independent study and they're bringing them in and they're setting appointments. Each site needs their own window in our organization because each is very unique. And so we don't take advantage of all six because we don't have six sites, but we do create three separate windows for ours. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this information timely and useful.